Hello, good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello, my How are you? Fine. Okay, that's good. How's, how's the weather? Cool. It's cool, huh? Very nice. In San Miguel, it's raining. Raining. All day? All day. Yes. All day. But the so so or heavy rain? Heavy rain and medium, but heavy and medium. Okay, what about the what about the rivers? Has the level increased? Yes, Rio Grande is, is Okay. It's the one that has increased it's dangerous. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you are in your house. Mm -hmm. you, did, you didn't go out? No. Okay, that's good. So you have to keep yourself safe, right, in these days. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Well, but but tomorrow there is supposed to be more more rain, right? So it's going to be rainy. Here where I live, it's been rainy, but not too much. And the wind is, like, say, uh, mild. Okay, suave, right? Mild. It's How not very. Say, uh, sorry. How do you say viento in English? Wind. Wind. The wind. Uh -huh. The wind here, for example, have been like mild. Mild is suave, just like a breeze, not too much. Okay, no strong winds. Okay, so that's uh, that's uh, let's say an advantage, because I have the volcano of San Salvador behind me, so it it protects me from the wind, right? But uh, when they come from the ocean, when they come from the Pacific, then it's flat. You know, they get me to the, in the front. But in this moment, is the on the on my back. I have the volcano, so I have that def, that let's say like defense in that sense. Okay, but thank God everything will be okay. Okay, good. And let's see what else do we have for today. Questions about the platform, guys? Any exercise difficulties? Remember that sometimes there are problems with the spelling or periods or stuff like that. Okay. Um, did you get all the? Did you send all your documents to English Corporativo? Because uh, they told me that today is the last day. Of to, to send them, right? So then uh, you can be registered. On Monday, we're going, we are going to start the next level. So the, the last one of this year, okay? So the year is basically, practically over, right? So one more, four more weeks of classes, then you will have vacation, and then we have to wait for 2021, right? So it's very fast, okay, very fast. And in, 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 in our house all year, <laughs> all the year in the house, right? So then, well, different year, okay? We will remember 2020. Okay, guys, good. Well, let me know if you have questions, right, about the, the platform or any other, oh, wait a minute, just let me. Need to change to P for intermediate two. Yes. And then we have no emails right now. Okay, P1. All right. Okay, so remember that yesterday we were talking about present perfect, right? <clears throat> okay. 
we're going to have a a quick review of the video. Hi, in this lesson we will study present perfect with already and yet. Ask and answer questions in present perfect with irregular and regular past participles. I want you to concentrate on this new tense. Notice how it is formed. Pay close attention to the words already and yet. Present perfect. Already, yet. The present perfect is formed with the verb have plus the past participle. Have you been to a jazz club? Yes, I've been to several. No, I haven't been to one. Has she ridden in a streetcar? Yes, she's ridden in one. No, she hasn't ridden in one. Has he called home lately? Yes, he's called twice this week. No, he hasn't called in months. Have they eaten dinner yet? Yes, they've already eaten. No, they haven't eaten yet. Contractions I've equals I have. You've equals you have. He's equals he has. She's equals she has. It's equals it has. We've equals we have. They've equals they have. Haven't equals have not. Hasn't equals has not. For present perfect, we will use have or has plus past participle verb plus complement. The verb have or has will depend on the person we will talk about. We use present perfect when we want to express actions which began in the past and continue in the present. Example, she has worked in the bank for five years. We have had the same car for 10 years. When we want to make reference to an unfinished temporary period of time, I have worked hard this week. It has rained a lot this year. We haven't seen her today. Repeated actions in a specific period of time between the present and the past. They have seen that film six times. We have eaten all that restaurant many times. When timing is not relevant or it is unknown. Someone has eaten my soup. Now let's talk about already and yet. Already usually goes after have or has and before the main verb. Examples, we have already had our breakfast. When are you going to do your homework? But I've already done it. Yet means that something that we expected has happened or hasn't happened. We usually put it at the end of a sentence. Examples, has the post arrived yet? Have you done your homework? Not yet. Haven't you got ready yet? Look at the time. Okay. Then we have this one. That before. Okay, we have the Let's see the statements or sentences. Okay, affirmative sentences. We have, um, let's say, when we use I, you, we, they, remember for affirmative sentences we use, I have eaten sushi. You have eaten sushi. We have eaten sushi. They have eaten sushi. Okay, uh, then you can use I haven't eaten sushi. And if you want to practice with I, wait a minute, I'm going to use um, this type of letter and a bigger one, let's say 16. Okay, I have already eaten sushi. 
Okay. This is an affirmative sentence. What would be the negative, Jenny? What would be a negative sentence? The same sentence, but in negative. I haven't. Okay. Mm -hmm. Already eaten sushi. I haven't eaten. Eaten. Sushi. Sushi. Yet. Yet. That's correct. Okay. So you see here. We have uh, already, and he, here we have, yet, okay, in the negative sentence, okay? So then we can say, I haven't. And if we are, then we can say now, for example, Jenny, Jenny has already eaten sushi. Okay, what would be the negative, Elena? Jenny hasn't eaten sushi yet. Okay, hasn't eaten sushi. Remember, you can say eaten or eaten, right? Eaten, eaten, or eaten. Okay, so here we have affirmative sentences with a negative sentence, okay? Uh, we're going to do two exercises in this moment using affirmative and negative sentences, okay? So um, let's say that prepare a sentence, either affirmative or negative. No problem, okay? One sentence, everybody. Okay, prepare one sentence in affirmative or negative. Using I, something that you have done, okay? That you have already done or something that you haven't done yet, okay? So we have three, six. Try to use different verbs, right? We can use Soul, bacon, uh, played, uh, broken. Uh, here I am using the participle forms, right? Broken, uh, sat, in. Done. Uh, worked. Written. Uh, let me see what else. Read. Read. Taken. We can also use uh, fold. Shown. Walked. Run. Uh, what else? Begun. Oh. 
all. Right. And see, thought. Vote. Wrote. Out. And carrot driven Okay, so these are, you know, some verbs uh, that you can use in the... as participle form. Okay. What's the What's the present of soul? Cell. Cell. Uh huh. Cell. Soul. Broken. Break. Sat. Sit. Sit. Sin. So. That's the past and the present. See. See. Done. Done. Do. Do. Worked. Work. 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 Written. Write. Write. Read. 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 Remember this one is red, red, red. The same, right? Uh, take. Take. Taken. Take. Take. Taken. <laughs> I erase it. Take. <laughs> Taken. Take. A uh, tall. Tell. Tell. Shown. Shown. Show. Como ver. Uh huh. Show. 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 Uh, walked. Walk. Walk. Run. Run. It's the same, right? Run. Only the past tense changes, Ren. Uh, begun. Begin. Begin. Cold. 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 Uh, played. Played. Tried. Tried. Try. Try. Thought. Think. 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 Bought. Bye. Bye. By, brought, bring, bring, okay, bring, talked, talk, 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 right, carrot, carry, Car carry, driven, dry, 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 okay, so then we have. Also, there's like hit. It's the same, right? Hit, hit, hit. The similar in todos, right? What is and, hit, teacher? Huh? Hit. What is hit? Hit a car. Hit the table. Uh, hit something, right? When you hit with a bat or with your hand. Okay. So that it's is like hit. beat. No. Hit is only a hit that you can... He hit me, right? But when you say he bit me, <laughs> yes, okay. there were many, many hits. Okay, many hits. And then you couldn't, it was a storm, a storm of hits. Okay, then what else? Bitten. Bit, bit, bitten. Bit, bit, bitten. 
Okay, we have the aporreado, right? What else? Okay, so then you have here, so we have, let me see, two, four, six, eight, 15, four, six, seven, that's uh, 22, like 25 verbs in that little, you see, 25 verbs is a lot, right? Okay, you can tell me many sentences and others, right? Danced, then we have danced, eaten, that we didn't use, we didn't use here, danced, uh, eaten, uh, we have a uh, cooked, uh, lived, uh, as a teacher, taught, okay, teach, taught, taught, uh, excuse me? Help, 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 uh -huh. help, uh, F E L T. Yes, felt. Uh -huh. Yes, thank you. And also falling. All fell fallen. Okay. Picked. Okay. Picked up. Uh, what else? Smelled. What else? What other verbs? Tell me other verbs that you remember. Sun. Sun. <laughs> Sung. Jump. Sung or Jump. Um, excuse me, yeah, Alan. Jump. No, it's, that's right. Jump. I don't know. I drop. And the driving. Driving. Driving is okay. Mm -hmm. Dance. Dance, uh huh. Yes, danced. It's here. Brushed. Okay. Brushed. Brush, brush. Uh -huh, yes. Brough. Brushed. Okay. Applied. Brushed. Applied. I have applied to a new job. I have applied three times to that new job. Okay, he aplicado, then you can use that one too. Okay. Sent. Okay. Think about other verbs. Okay. Do you have any questions about this uh, vocabulary? No problem. Okay. Because if you have no problem with this uh, verbs, is is uh, let's say a good good vocabulary, right? So then imagine. So we're gonna have some kind of columns. Let's try to kind of organize this. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. No problem. Now tell me that then you tell me your sentences. Okay using this verb. So here, imagine you have two, four, six, seven, 14, 21, 28, 35, 40 verbs, okay, in this, okay, that's a lot. Okay, good. One volunteer.
Okay, volunteer. Who volunteers? Okay, Eduardo. Okay. Tell me a sentence, <coughs> affirmative or negative? Affirmative. Okay. I have already played basketball. Okay, very good. Good. I have already you. played basketball. Uh huh. Go, Luis. I have already done the Saturday for night. I have already dance. Dance. I have dance. Already on Saturday night. Okay. Saturday. I have already <coughs> I have already danced on Saturday night. Okay, yes. good. Who else? Yes, Alan. I haven't taken a shower yet. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I haven't <laughs> taken a shower yet. It's very cold, Alan. It's very cold. Yes. Okay. Don't 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 take it in the pila, right? Take it in the bathroom no, no, no. because in the, the water from the pila is cold in this moment. Cold. Yes. Yes. Okay. Good. Sounds you know like a whip. Very Latigazos, cool. right? Very cold. Okay, good. Uh, Elena? Okay. I haven't broken any bond yet. Any? Any bond. Oh my God, are you a bone breaker? Bone, uh, what's up? Huh, yes. No, Where you say, it? I haven't, but do you break bones? No. Okay, <laughs> but then you can say, I haven't broken any of my bones yet. Uh, any, oh, okay. Uh -huh, because if you say, I haven't broken any bones yet, it means I'm waiting for someone to break his bones. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Sounds very aggressive. Okay. Very... Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. Al Jazeera. Al Jazeera. Al Jazeera. <laughs> so it's uh, then you have to say I haven't broken any of my bonds yet. Okay. Thank any of my bonds. God. Okay. Good. All right, Manuel. Manuel Alberto, you tell me. Sorry, teacher. No problem. Uh, I don't read the Bible. The the verse. I don't. I don't read the the Bible, the, the Biblia. Ah, uh, I haven't. I, I haven't, haven't read, read the Bible yet. The Bible. Okay, I haven't read the Bible yet. Well, okay. me neither. Not completely, right? Just part of it, but completely. Mm, I don't think so. Okay. Eh, Beatriz. I haven't seen three movies in one day yet. Okay, I haven't seen three movies in one day yet. Okay, thank you. Very good. Andres. Teacher, tendríamos que usar el jet. No, not really. But uh, or already, you could use already or or nothing. No, solo sería one sentence. Mm -hmm. Okay. I work uh, this day. I worked. I have worked this day. Okay. I have worked this day. Good. Marian. Marian, Marian Mejia. Okay, I, I haven't run a marathon yet. I haven't run a marathon yet. Okay, good. Luis Alberto. Okay, teacher. I broke in a tube with a tortilla. <laughs> with a toasted tortilla. Okay, <laughs> I have broken a tooth. With a bro with a toasted tortilla, okay, a toaster or a frozen, okay, okay, frozen tortilla, okay, good, Marina. I haven't sent the email yet. I haven't sent the email yet. Very good. I like this. This the kind of sentence is good because it's very practical, right? Because this is what you do every day. For example, I haven't sent the emails yet. I, I haven't answered, right? 
I haven't answered the email yet. Okay, you can also use answered. Okay, I haven't answered the email yet. I haven't read the email yet. I haven't finished the monthly report yet. I haven't finished the weekly report yet. Okay, this is a vocabulary expression that probably you can use in your jobs, okay? Um, I haven't, uh, let's say, I haven't paid my credit, I haven't paid my credit card yet. Oh my God. Okay, um, I haven't, I haven't received my salary yet. <laughs> okay, I haven't received, I haven't gotten my salary yet. Uh, I haven't saved money this month. Okay. I have spent I have spent too much money this month. Okay? Expressions that you can use during the day. Thank you very much. No questions in this moment? No? Okay. Then you can uh, probably use an expression. Now I want you to use an expression using uh, the third person, okay? Just the third person. For example, you can say, uh, my sister hasn't, hasn't studied today, okay? Or you can also say, my sister has not called me. Okay, has not called me this week. All right. Uh, what else can we say? Um, my, let's say my nephew, my nephew has played soccer. Okay, at the stadium many times. Okay, my nephew has played soccer at the stadium many times. Uh, I have never, no, okay, my nephew has never, no, my niece, my niece has never danced lambara, okay, or my niece has never danced, uh, let's say, uh, ballet, all right? So then you can use this, the same verb, but now using the third person. He, she, or my dog, it, okay, my dog, has not uh, gone. Okay, so there's another one here that we can use. Gone out today. All right. Good. Let's begin with Marina, then Elena, and then Alan. Third person. He, she, it. Hello, Marina. Hello, teacher. Uh, sentence with... He, she, or it. Uh -huh. Then you're going to use this. Like Jenny has already eaten sushi. You can say my husband, my friend, uh, my boyfriend has already, uh, has already seen that movie. Okay. My daughter... My daughter has play soccer. Okay, my daughter has played soccer. Okay, good. Thank you, Marina. Helena? Okay. No. My mother hasn't sold a car yet. My mother hasn't sold a car yet. Good, okay. Alan? My wife, my wife hasn't taken a shower yet. Okay, very good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Minor? Carlos has a working to Sunday. Okay, Ma, uh, Carlos has a work work Sunday. Okay, uh -huh. Carlos has worked on Sundays. Uh -huh. Okay, Manuel? 
my brother-in-law has a dance the bachata. Okay, very good. Excellent. Luis. Okay, teacher. Um, uh, my brother hasn't paid his bill yet. Hasn't paid uh -huh, his bill yet. Okay, very good. Okay, hasn't yes. paid his bill yet. Uh, Marion. I, my son has broken hand this year. Uh, who, my? My son. Okay, yes. Mm -hmm. Broken? Has broken? My, my, my son has broken? His hand? Hand, hand this year. Okay, his hand this year. Okay, that's correct. My son has broken his hand this year. Okay, good. Thank you. Eduardo? Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, Manuel. Let me check. Manuel has, has already had a beard. Okay, has already had a beer. Okay, good. He's in a bad I have one. a question for, for this sentence. Uh -huh. ha, had or drunk? Has had. So it's one. Or you can say drunk. Yes. Okay. I had a, I had a couple of beers last night. I, I drank. Yes. It's more commonly used drunk, but you can use had. Okay. okay. So sure. Manuel and Luis has already drunk a half. In that, in that case, will be half. Half. Uh -huh. Because he, two person. Uh -huh, exactly, it's they. Okay, it would be okay. similar to this with they. Okay, they have. Okay. Okay, if you only say Manuel, it's he. Okay, good. Thank you, Eduardo. Okay. Uh, Jenny? Uh, Mary hasn't bought new house yet. Mary hasn't bought a new house yet. Okay. Beatrice. Um. My niece hasn't fallen in love yet. Yeah, hey, that's a good one. Exactly right. My niece hasn't fallen in love yet. Okay, that's okay. Very good. Okay, uh, who else? And uh, now we have oh, Osvaldo. Osvaldo. Hola, teacher. Okay. Is the only family members? Yes, no, no, it can be a friend. It can be a friend, it can be okay. an, en an enemy. My friend. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My friend hasn't uh, played FIFA this day. Okay, very good. Okay, you can say my, uh, my worst enemy have, hasn't found me yet, okay? In my case, right? So, <laughs> so he's is still looking for he's is still looking for me. All right. No, but they say my friend hasn't played FIFA today. Okay, that's good. That's a good one. Okay, guys. Then we see, for example, that we can use the sentences uh, with uh, I, we, you, they, using have, affirmative or negative. We only have have or haven't. If we are going to use the third person, he, she, it, only one person in the sentence, but it's not me, or it's not you, then we, we are going to use has or hasn't, or affirmative or negative, okay? Then, these are the, if you see, statements, affirmative, have, 
negative haven't, and then the complement. He, she, has, or hasn't. And then we also have the yes, no questions. What do we do in the yes, no question? Ya viste. Cubre todo Centroamérica, Lureka. Okay, good. No, wait. Okay, here. Then we say, ask yes, no questions. Have you? Have you seen? Have you studied? Have you drank? And then we can use here all the same verbs that we have okay in on the list on the list that we were writing at the beginning okay for example here we have these questions have you sold have you broken what else have you sold have you sold your car yet have you broken uh, have you seen that movie yet? Okay, you can say no, I haven't, or yes, I have. These are yes, no questions. What, what could be a question you see any of these verbs? Who wants to try asking a question? Have you cooked a lasagna? Have you cooked lasagna? Have you made? Is another word that you can use here, right? Have you made lasagna for dinner? Have you cooked and cooked? No, we, we haven't used cook, right? Yes, it's already it's there. It's already here? Yes. Next to yes. eaten. Yes. Okay, cooked. It's there. Okay, what else? Another just a question? Is another just a question? Have they felt happy in the party? Have they? Repeat, please. I didn't hear the bird. Jenny, have they? Jenny, yeah. your microphone, your microphone is off. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's why I didn't hear. <laughs> have they felt happy in the party? Have they felt? Yes. Mm -hmm. Have they felt? Sorry. Happy? No, it's okay. No problem. No, I, the first time I didn't hear the, the bear. Okay, look, now I want you to think about real situ situations now in this day or in these days or something that is uh, very realistic, right? In which uh, situation would you use a yes, no question using have, okay? For example, uh, have you gotten Have you gotten sick? Uh, let's say uh, lately. Have you felt? Have you felt? Uh, let's say, have you felt sick lately? Okay. What is lately? Where's lately? Recentemente. Uh -huh, recently, right? Recently. That's correct. Okay, have you felt sick lately? Have you spent a lot of money uh, this month or lately or these days? Okay, uh, have you applied to a new job? Okay, have you sent all your documents to, uh, let's say, to the 
I don't know, to the bank, okay? Situations in which you will use this. Okay, think about one yes, no question, okay? Using one verb in a situation that you will probably use in your house or in your job, in the real life. Have you? You can use all these verbs. Have you driven every day this week? Have you eaten pupusas lately? I have. Okay, ready? Okay, you had time to think. Okay, volunteers, or shall we be use? Sure. Yes. Hello. How do you play soccer any day? Have you played soccer any day this week? Uh, no, I haven't. Okay, no, I haven't. Okay, good. Another question. I have one. Yes, Beatrice, go ahead. Have you talked with your relatives in these days? Uh, no, I haven't. Okay, and that's true, okay? Then you said, no, I haven't. Good. Uh, another question? No question. Come on, ask another question. Ask another question. Elena? I think a question in the third person. It's okay. okay. It's okay, no problem. Okay. Has your daughter made, made the um, final exam? Yet. <laughs> yet? Sorry, uh, yet. <laughs> well, actually, no, she hasn't. She's missing one. Okay. It was supposed to be today. Okay. It was supposed to be today, but they, well, if they were supposed to be two weeks ago, then they suspended and they began last Thursday. So she had Thursday, Friday, and yesterday, Monday. And today she was supposed to have the last one, but she was not able to. Yes, she's you know, waiting for, and only that, that test to finish the school year. Can you believe? Only, and with that one, it's they, very sad because yes. all the children ha, uh, decide to the, the finish exactly. to the so school. They, <laughs> that they are frustrated, right? Oh my yes. God, I have to wait another day. Okay, good. Uh, another question, Luis? Teacher, have you bad this day? Have you felt? Bad, bad. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Wow, have you, <laughs> have you taken, have you taken a bath? Taken a bath this day? Oh, yes. Al Alan, Alan hasn't. Okay. Oh, no, no. Yes, it was not Alan. Yes, Alan, right? No, but I have. <laughs> because Alan went to the gym and then I didn't go to the gym. No, no but I... No, no, no. I fat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So then, um, yeah, but I, uh, I have. Question, Alan. Ask me a question. Have you? Oh, I see. Mm. Have you paid your bills yet? Just a credit card. I have it. No, but it's, oh. uh, it's no, but it's next week. Okay, let's say uh, yes. Yes, I have. In this moment, yes. Okay, next week, I don't know, <laughs> but I hope so. Okay. Um, it, Jenny, question?
do you cook it? Cook it? Have you? Have you cooked? Have, uh, sorry. Have you cooked a lasagna in this week? Uh, no, I haven't. Actually, no. Okay. I I made some hamburgers last Saturday, but no, I haven't cooked this uh, lasagna this week. Okay, uh, Manuel, question. Have you written a song? Have you? Have you written? Written, huh? Written? Written a song? Oh, no, no, I haven't. I am a terrible singer, actually. Okay. Uh, let me see. Marian, Marian, question. How do you ride a bike? A bike? Uh, have you ridden? Have you ridden a bike? Ridden. Yes, but long time ago, the last time. Yes, I have, but not lately. Okay, yes, I have, but not lately. Okay, Eduardo? Okay. Okay, have you called your mother this week? Uh, no, I haven't. Okay, no, I haven't. You are but a I bad. Have, but, yes. <laughs> so. No. <laughs> no, the thing is that I don't have a mother now. Okay, she's she she departed. Okay, okay. and then that's why. Okay, good, yeah. Marina. Have you say money this month? Say money this month. Uh, yes, like ten dollars, I guess. In the, yes, in my in my piggy bank. You know the piggy bank? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yes, I have a piggy bank. So Ten dollars only. Okay. Good. Uh, what else? Uh, who's missing? Andres. Andres is missing. Have you danced final? Uh, Past a year? Oh yes, of course I have. Yes, <laughs> but not not this year. Okay, because... <laughs> I have before. Yes, I have, but not not now. How oh. podríamos decir ahí que el año pasado past year? No, last year, last year. Last year. Uh -huh. okay. But then uh, you can use in past when you use last year, last year, then you use simple past. You say, did you dance last year? Did you dance last Christmas? Did you dance uh, for the end of the year, last year? Okay, that, that's past tense. Okay, good. Okay, everybody, now we have a practice. My goodness, the wind is blowing. The, it's increasing. Okay. Now, any questions about the present perfect? We have just no questions. Then we have the affirmative and negative sentences. And then we also can have, now we can also see the, hey, where is it? Okay. Okay, we have some questions here using the Okay, use the present perfect, use the verbs in brackets. Okay, you tell me A, B or C. Yes, no questions. C. C. E. No. Have you done much exercise this week? All right. The answer in the number two, A, B, or C? C. C, two. C, two. Yes, I have already been to aerobic class four times. I have been to. Good. Number three. Yes, no question. A. Look at the verb, uh huh. Play, correct, past participle, have you played? Have because it's you. Okay, have in this case, no. 
because play is not in past participle. Good. Next one. Z. Z, C, C, no, uh -huh. Because the, the past participle of uh, have is have. Haven't had. Okay, no, I haven't had the time. Okay, uh, have you played any sports this month? No, I haven't had the time. Five. How many? B. B. Uh, have been. How been? How many movies? Ah, okay, movies Have in you... this case. In this case, está como la sala de cine. Okay. Mm -hmm. How many movies? Have. 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 Have you been? How been? Have you been to this month? Okay. Actually, ah, oh, there is a mistake here. Aquí debe ser, aquí, ajá, aquí debe ser sin. Okay, mm -hmm. that has been. And here, actually, haven't. I seen. haven't seen. I haven't seen. Uh -huh. hey, hey. I haven't seen. Hey. Yet. Number seven. C. Letter C. Uh, this uh, one? C. No. No, because B. you have our letter? B. 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 Uh -huh. hey, no. Because it, B no, is no. the past Have participle thing. Have you been to any interesting parties recently? No? Yes, yes, sorry. I haven't. Haven't? What? Haven't gone. A, A B, or C? C. B. C. C. Uh -huh, because we have go, present, went, past, past gone, gone, past participle. Number nine. Hey. 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 Have you called any friends today? Ten. A hey. two. A hey, two. Yes. Um. Uh, Okay, yes, I've already made, oh, yes. Okay, good. Now that's it. Let's check. Okay, this is correct. This one's this one. Also correct. And there you go. Okay, remember it is important to observe when you have this exercise, do, don't, have, you, be, been, I have, oh. no, I has, okay? Estas dos podrían ser, pero we have I has, no, I have. Eh, have you played? And the other one is have had be been. Aunque aquí debieron haber usado sin, okay? Because we're talking about the movies. And pero igual the other ones, for example, is are in present. This is be in present. This is the past participle. Then C sin. Be, been, go, gone, right? We have to use past participle. Call, called, okay? And then we have make and made. Okay? So that's... And then for tomorrow we have breakfast. Uh, let's say uh, tomorrow we're going to have a difference between the present perfect and the simple past. Okay, we're gonna have this difference. Simple past and present. When to use present perfect and when we use the simple past. Okay, people? Any questions about it? No? 
No questions, Michelle. No questions. Le voy a poner ese documento de Word que estamos viendo ahí en el grupo de WhatsApp, right? Okay. Eh, para que repasen preguntas y, y le voy a agregar a ese mismo de past tense for tomorrow, okay? And I will give it back to you again on, on tomorrow night, okay? All right, people, so have a very good night. Don't go out if it's not necessary. Don't get wet. If you go out, put on a sweater, take your umbrella, okay? And take care. So good night. Bye-bye. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye-bye. Good night.